Welcome, hello, and welcome to a new pick a card. My name is Anna Robertson in Just Whisper. I am a medium since I was young. I am a healer, psychic, and tarotist here in YouTube. And me and my team of light, <laughs> we feel so blessed for your presence. So let's do a new pick a card and let's see about how your soulmate will express their feelings and the love towards you from the very first beginning, from the first second. So my loves, I want to share with you the service that I use in order to receive more personalized and private readings. And this is Purple Garden, who is sponsoring today's video. Purple Garden helps you to connect with talented astrologers, psychic and tarotists advisors. These advices from Purple Garden are ready to enlighten you, inspire you and empower you so you can create your dream life. And all of them are vetted and voted by people like you. All you have to do is create an account and you'll be able to choose from the hundreds of advisors who are online right now. Is he or she thinking about you? What is next for your love life? Want to know how to make your relationship stronger? So Purple Garden has an advisor ready for you. So there's no sugar coating. These incredible advisors that are so talented are going to go directly to the point. They're going to be very specific, very straightforward, and they're going to bring you a lot of clarity to your problem, to your situation, to your future. You can choose whichever advisor suits best your needs, and you'll be able to connect with them via text chat, video call, phone call. What I love about Purple Garden, and in this case, this helped me a lot, is that each advisor, they have like a short video presentation and you will know instantly if you're going to connect with them or not. And as a new Purple Garden customer, you will get your first $10 matched up to $10. So you just have to go to the oral or my link, which is down below in the description or in the comment section. And if you tap into my direct link, which is, you can see on the screen, it's trypurplegarden.com slash Anna Robertson. You will get this incredible offer. You just have to put $10. Purple Garden automatically sums up $10 into your account. And there you go. You can choose whatever advisor is more suitable for you that would really help you to have an amazing life. So my loves, thank you so much for sticking around. Now let's continue and you will see right now the three cards and the three groups. So I will see you in a few seconds. Welcome again, my loves, how are you doing? So as I was saying before, let's see how your soulmate is going to express you from the very beginning their feelings, okay? How they're going to express you their love towards you because not everyone expresses love the same way. I think it's going to be very magical and interesting. I hope you guys, you like it. So as you can see, we have three groups over here. And if it's the first time that you're doing a pick a card, how it works is that you have to choose between one of the three groups. It is true, as it is a general reading, that some people, some viewers, they listen to a group, some they, they you know, you know, guys, that if I see synchronicities between two groups, I'm going to tell you, I think that you should check out another group. Okay, it's up to you. Follow your heart, follow your instinct. So, my loves, and again, the timing as always in the description and the link of Purple Garden so you can support my work. It's in the comment section and the description. And again, thank you so much for the ones that you're going to proceed. So my loves, group number one, the card of the sun with the yellow feather. Group number two with the blue feather and temperance, la templanza. And group number three with the green feather, el mago, the magician.
So I'm going to leave you guys to connect with the groups and I will see you in just a few seconds. And please, my loves, don't forget to subscribe. Give me a like. It's going to help me to reach more people. I will see you right now. Group number one, what a beautiful card that you have chosen. And I have just realized because, you know, guys, most of you guys, you know me, <laughs> uh, the old subscribers that I'm more a medium and I'm very, and a lot of what I do, what I say, 99% is because spirit tells me to do or to, <laughs> to say. And I didn't notice that I chose the yellow feather with the card of the sun. <laughs> wow. It makes sense, right? So this is telling me already that from the very beginning, uh, this card is talking about joy. This talks about inspiration as well. So from the very beginning, both of you guys, you're going to feel very inspired to continue to know one another. The way your soulmate is going to express the love towards you, it's as the card says, and the yellow feather is going to be very positive with you. Okay. It's going to be they are going to tell you, oh my gosh, I know that I, I know because I know myself. Well, maybe they're not going to, to, to choose the exact words, but understand me in <laughs> group number one. But I'm listening from spirit, something like that. The idea like, I know I'm highly creative, but since I met you, this is what the spirit are telling me. Since I met you, I am even double creative than I was. Or maybe even some of them, they're going to tell you, oh my gosh. I have been willing to write a novel, to write maybe a book for kids, but I was not inspired at all. But since we met the first moment, the first time, the first date, I, I, I cannot stop writing. I cannot stop receiving ideas. It's like you are that boost. Your soulmate is going to tell you that. Maybe this is not something new for mo most of you guys maybe you're used to this that you touch people's energy you touch their soul and suddenly they are like very happy they jump out of joy of happiness of inspiration of creativity and i feel group number one and i know that you're here because of your soulmate but if some of you you were having doubts that you have that effect on others absolutely not you are joy you are pure positivity you're pure abundance. You're somebody that you are brilliant. You are somebody that you manifest your dreams quickly and easily. And maybe some of you guys are going to think, no, Anna, I don't feel like that right now. I tell you that that's your destiny. And I have to be sincere, group number one. I always say this expression. It's so funny. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm laughing at myself. <laughs> I always say, I have to be sincere. <laughs> Sorry, guys. So I am laughing because you have such a great vibe, both of you guys. So your soulmate is going to express you. I think that both of you guys, you're going, to, you're going to express the love very similarly in a very joyful way, in a very happy way. You're going to laugh. Like I have just done laughing at myself, like a very natural laugh. I feel that your soulmate, you're going to sense that they love you, that they care about you, that there's something really special and magical between both. Because you, you can sense the smile, it's natural, not fake. I know that this seems silly, but it's not. I mean, if you want to write down below in the comment section, group number one, have you noticed that not everyone can smile naturally? Not everyone can vibe in a positive way. Not everyone vibrates in joy. <laughs> Not everyone is happy for the happiness of others. I know that for all of you guys, this is normal, or this is the way you think 
life and relationship and love should be. But not everyone can be like this. I know that, well, let me correct myself. Everyone can vibrate like this. But it's true that both of you guys, your soulmate and you, you have this ability, you have this natural vibe of being happy and being positive to others. Maybe, and, and this, is, this is true because the spirits are telling me that, maybe some of you, you're passing through challenges and you have passed through tough challenges. But nevertheless, both of you guys, you and your soulmate, you're fighters. You're like this unicorn. The unicorn is this beautiful, this beautiful representation of magic. Magic is inside of you. So the way your soulmate is going to express their love towards you, it's going to be always relationship going forward, the unicorn going forward, okay, and excitement, okay? The unicorn, the pose of the unicorn, for me, it's like excitement. So this is beautiful. So the first... The first impression, I believe, from both of you guys, and the first, the, the first time they're going to express their love towards you, their feelings, it's going to be with a lot of positivism, with a lot of joy, with a lot of excitement, okay? And you're going to wake up, group number one, like jumping, like this unicorn, like maybe until now, somebody wakes you up, maybe you're living with roommates or your family or maybe your animals or maybe your alarm <laughs> clock, but I feel you like jumping out of the bed like you've never, ever, ever in your life have woken up so happy ever in your life the way you are doing or you're just about to do when you meet your soulmate. Remember this. <laughs> and I'm listening to the song you are unforgettable. You are unforgettable. Okay? You're not going to forget about this message. And you're going to remember the moment you met this soulmate. You're going to wake up happy. So I'm so happy for you because your soulmate is going to give you that positive boost that I'm sure that most of you guys, you give to the rest, but you were waiting for somebody at last to give you. And I know that many of you, you have very nice family members and friends that they're very, they're they are like you. They have that, that nice and natural happy vibe. But your soulmate is like that as well. So I'm, I'm, I'm happy. And both of you guys, you believe in magic, okay? This is going to be a very magical connection. I feel that both of you in the future, you're going to remember the first connections and the way you even you encounter yourself first like very magical let us shuffle some or some sorry some tarot based in right of weight these are new cards <laughs> so this is telling me that many of you this is somebody new okay that you have not met your soulmate yet but let us see what comes out i'm going to shuffle a little bit more because they are new i have not shuffled a lot before so let us shuffle better I'm so happy for you, <laughs> group number one. Wow, my gosh, the Queen of Cups. Wow, the Queen of Cups. And I love this card because you can read it. So your soulmate is going to be very loving. You know, guys, that the cups, it's emotions, feelings. So they are going to, you're going to sense that they love you because they're going to have gestures of compassion. Okay, they're going to be very loving from the very first moment. They're going to be very kind with you. They're going to, as it says here, self-sacrificing. In what sense, very interesting that it appears here, self-sacrificing. I've never, I've never read in any of the books of Tarot that the Queen of Cups is self-sacrificing. But in a way, as I said before, you are like that. And look at that, I'm feeling goosebumps with the angel Tarot. Maybe, maybe loves, you should choose a group number two as well, because we have over there the temperance and we have an angel over there, okay? Now, this is telling me that both of you guys, you have a lot of angel vibes. Maybe in the past lives, you were angels. And that's why you have that tendency of giving, 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 giving to the rest. But I am listening from God, from spirit from the universe, from angels, it is the time for you to receive. Okay, here it says psychic, deep psychic insights, caring for others, but forgetting to take care of yourself. And I feel this is talking about you and your soulmate. Trust your intuition, a deep love of family and friends, follow your heart. So 
Your soulmate is going to tell you from the very beginning that they are listening completely to the heart, not to their mind with you. And I'm not telling you that their mind is saying something wrong or negative about this connection. No, not at all. But if sometimes fear appears, and this is something natural, we are all of us, we are humans, we are living this human experience, your soulmate is going to make sure to relax in those moments and is always going to communicate what they're feeling. I have to be sincere, my love. I mean, uh, I know that it sounds crazy, but I, I think I am falling in love with you. I am listening to that. I feel that from the very first moment, they're going to tell you about their feelings. I am falling in love. I care about you. I know that maybe you don't believe me because we have just met a week ago, a month ago, two days ago, but I care about you. And I assure you they're telling you the truth. And I feel that both of you guys, you're going to feel the same. Because both of you guys, you have such a magical and psychic connection between both of you that you know he or she is not lying. You know your soulmate is not lying. Both of you guys, you are lie detectors. So that's why you like people that are natural. What we were saying before, he, your soulmate, he or she, your soulmate does not have a fake smile, has not, does not have a fake love. This is true and pure connection, loving connection. Let us have another one. I am listening from spirit group number one. Do not worry so much about the timing. Worry about the quality. And this is what you're bringing, okay? Your soulmate is bringing quality, okay? The, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Wow, 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 the star. Look at that. Have faith. The future is bright. Dreams come true. Positive changes. And again, about talking about positivity, as we were said in the beginning. Positive changes that bring an end to challenging times, the light and the end of the tunnel. And the star, you know, guys, that it's the card of a wish that it's fulfilled, wish fulfillment. So your dream of that connection, so the way they're going to express you love, it's going to be like a dream, like a dream coming true, like a dream coming true. This is a dream for you, okay? And, and I'm talking a lot about dreams, so this is telling me already that this is Aquarius energy, okay? And this is Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This is telling me already, my loves, that, um, that both of you guys, you have met through your dreams. Yes, shuffle some oracle. So th from the very beginning, group number one, your soulmate is going to express you their love in a very natural way, in a very open way. They're not going to be afraid. Although maybe sometimes they're going to feel a little bit of fear, but it's understandable. That, that fear is not going to block them. If that's, a, if that's a worry for you, don't worry at all. So, wow, physical connection. Look at that. The sacred union of bodies to becoming one. Look at that. Maybe some of you guys, you never had uh, sex before or this sort of intimacy before. Maybe you had sex, but you never connected this way. This is going to be absolutely beautiful, magical. And I love it because I sense like this. This reminds me of the fairy. Yes, this reminds me of this light of fairies, like magic, magical. I, th I feel group number one that your soulmate is going to express you their love uh, not only talking about their feelings but as well i feel that it's going to be equal the way they're going to feel towards you and the way they're going to uh, be attracted towards you i feel like a very beautiful balance i love you and i and really and i feel so attracted to you because let's let's be real in some connections there's a lot of feelings but there's not uh, the connection in bed it's not so good and in some other cases, the connection is bad, is amazing, but there's a lack of feelings. And this is not your case. You're and, and again, that's why you feel this is a dream coming true. 
a letter shuffle these are all of these cards are new <laughs> they arrived today so i'm so happy to use them with you and let us shuffle these ones oops i feel this one okay wow self-love look at that self-love self-concern self-healing independence and i feel group number one that your person it's going to show you all of this attraction all of this love but without forgetting about themselves and that's a good advice for you too both of you guys you're going to merge in this beautiful and magical connection but you're not going to forget about your needs and they're not going to forget about their needs and that's beautiful this is a healthy relationship both of you guys you have done such a beautiful self-love you you have healed yourself you're healing yourself you're taking care of yourself you're giving yourself time love understanding comprehension you have been healing your inner child and this is telling me that that's why this connection is going to be so positive so healthy and so magical we see the roses around so this is telling me that this relationship it's going to grow 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 and both of you guys you're going to grow all together okay beautiful wow my loves this is so beautiful okay let me let me focus and my sweeties i am going to shuffle okay two Two cards of the tea leaf oracle well that was quick <laughs> oh my gosh and we have the ego wow triumph over troubles obstacles and again whatever challenge wh how really again because i am i'm sensing a lot of circumstances because it's many of you okay this is how you're not reading and uh, that's why i recommend you guys the, the link of purple garden but i sense that some of you guys you live in different countries some of you guys maybe you're very busy with work some of you guys you're struggling with some things so whatever you're struggling with right now whatever challenge or obstacle you're going through right now both of you guys you're going to overcome it i am listening together together your person is always, always going to give you, because the eagle, the animal totem of the eagle, this is the golden animal totem, which is very, um, uh, normally it's a representation of USA, but may, maybe some of you guys, you're not from USA, don't worry about that, and you, you're going to meet somebody else from a different part of the world. <laughs> but it's funny because this is, this is one of my, well, this is my main animal totem, and I, I had a very strong connection uh, yesterday. Okay, not this night, but two days ago. So this is not a coincidence. This is double confirmation of the messages I'm telling you. Okay? And I tell you, my loves, I feel group number one that both of you guys, you're going to become a star together or you're going to do something very important for in this reincarnation. I think that both of you guys, you are going to work together. Or you're going to do a project together that I am listening, and this is amazing, that it's going to save a lot of lives. Maybe you're going to save a lot of people that are struggling emotionally and that's why the Queen of Cups. Maybe some of you guys, you're going to heal a lot of people that has some that maybe they pass through some sort of abuse or maybe they have a blockage concerning sex and you're going to save a lot of lives. Maybe some of you guys, you're going to teach people how to heal themselves or you're going to empower people how, to, how they can self-love, how they can give themselves love. And you're going to save a lot of lives and I keep listening. Maybe some of you guys, you're meant to help others to achieve their goals. Or maybe you're going to sell a product that it's going to, to make their life easier. Or they're going to, or maybe a product that's going to inspire them. Maybe something creative. Again, I am keep listening. Both of you guys, you're going to save a lot of lives together. Okay. Wow. What a reading, group number one. And before we end up the reading, I want you to ask, if you want, <laughs> a specific question to angels. Let's see. 
You can ask two specific questions, okay? So question number one, please, angels, archangels, as the masters, could you answer group number one? This one? Unlikely. Okay, so first question, unlikely. Okay. And let's see about the second question. You are ready. Wow, what a change. And we see this beautiful Cleopatra. I think that many of you guys, you met in Atlantis or in, in ancient Egypt times. Yeah. Wow. And before we end up the reading, last question. <laughs> okay, third question, group number one. Okay. Yes, now this is the sign. Yes, indeed. And again, I was telling you guys about my, my really, it was some, it was really, I tell you guys, many of you, you know about astral journeys, astral trips, okay? And the dream that I had with the golden eagle, it was not just a dream. So I tell you, this is a sign, okay? Wow, group number one. I hope you have liked it. What a beautiful energy you and your soulmate have. And again, thank you so much for everything, for your likes and everything. I would love to see you in the next pick a card. And again, if you want to support my work so I can continue with the English channel as well as, as well as the Spanish one, you can support me using this incredible offer of Purple Garden. You just have to pay $10. They, they give you automatically $10 and you have a beautiful list of incredible psychics, intuitives, you know, remember that you have palm readers. This is so interesting. You have people over there that are professional at reading dreams as well. So thank you again so much, guys, if you're going to proceed with the link because they, I receive a compensation from Purple Garden. Have a beautiful day. Have, have, have a beautiful night wherever you are. Me and my team of light, we love you so much. Bless you. Bless this beautiful connection. Bless your soulmate. Bless your family. Bless your friends and your animals. No. I was going to say namaste. Sorry, guys. Namaste is hello in English. <laughs> Adios. Hello, group number two. <laughs> I hope you're doing amazing. And if that's not the case, I'm sure you will receive from angels. You know, guys, that I... It's not a coincidence I picked Anna Robertson Angels Whispers because I, I connect with a lot of beautiful light beings as well as starseed, okay, guides and masters. <clears throat> Sorry about my voice. Oh my gosh, this is telling me already that your soulmate, it's the first moment that they see you, they are not going to know what to tell you. It's like they're going to be like in shock. I am listening and I'm feeling the energy in my hands. So this is telling me as well that your soulmate, it's going to be like a healer. Maybe some of them, they're healers or they're therapists or they're teachers or they work in YouTube guiding and empowering others and inspiring others. But I feel with the energy in my hands because I am a healer as well that all soulmates here in group number two, and it's not a coincidence with the card of, of the temperance, all soulmates here are healers, are very balanced. They have a very beautiful balance. But again, my, my throat chakra is like closing, not in, a, not in a bad way, like but I sense like your soulmate is going to be very, very, very nervous the moment they see you. They're going to be like, <gasps> And we see here the representation of the two cups, yes? And this is like, this is talking about water, emotions, life, nourishing one to another one, equilibrium between both, balance, okay? It's not one gives 60% of love and the other one 40. It's not I do more and you do less. You do, you do more and I do less. No, this is a very beautiful, balanced relationship. And I feel that most of you guys... You could check out with my with my offer my offer of Purple Guardian uh, because that's going to confirm you that this information. But I feel that most of you guys you're going to meet during the night or the evening or maybe hanging out with some friends. It's your birthday. It's somebody else's birthday. It's a celebration. It's a wedding. I see cups like drinking, if not alcohol, drinking something with alcohol, a drink or a coffee. 
like somewhere where you can eat and drink. This I'm, sh well, again, this is a general reading, but I feel that this is a, this is going to be the case for many of you. And again, the moment they're going to see you, they're going to be like in shock. I know that they, maybe they're not going to give you that feeling because they give the feeling of like an angel, like smooth, I am relaxed, I am chilling out, I don't get nervous, I'm very confident, but deep, deep down inside, I feel like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, don't say anything stupid, breathe. Really, really, guys, I know that I'm sure, I'm sure they will tell you. If you don't resonate with this message, just choose another group. But if you resonate, I've, I know you feel it like true, this message, because I feel that your soulmate is going to be always very, very, very sincere but they're not going to tell you from the very beginning, I'm nervous. No, they're going to give you that appearance of, I am relaxed, I am confident. And in reality, in general, they are like that. Yes, they are. And they're very connected with angels. They love angels. Maybe they have figures of angels, or maybe they love to, or they have some of them, I'm listening even, that they have tattoos of angels or feathers. Or well, there's like, there's something about feathers, okay? And, uh, and it's not a, what a synchronicity, you know? The feathers that we have chosen. And with the blue, this is telling me that your soulmate is going to think of you. They're they going to express you their love, like in a very angelical and very warm way, very relaxed way, very balanced way. They're not going to be impulsive. Maybe they want to, maybe they feel like that. But they're going to, make sure they're relaxed because they have this idea group number two i am listening from spirit that if they vibrate in a balanced way if they behave in a balanced way they're going to attract somebody balanced and this is making me this is making me think think that maybe some of their past connections were very karmic and th those karmic relationships were, were very painful for them and that's why they started working with God with a, a religion maybe because I know that uh, here there's a very big <laughs> mix of cultures and religions but I feel that the moment they started to work with angels with angelical realm with God they started to believe in God in light universe the law of attraction, because this card as well, it's talking about alchemy, okay? So this is telling me that, again, however they're nervous they feel, however they may feel like in shock, I feel that they are going to recognize you very quickly. Maybe some of you guys, you're not going to recognize these soulmates, okay? I have to be sincere, but I feel that most of them, if not all, they're going to sense like, Oh my gosh, I think I have met the one. Please, 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 don't, don't show yourself full. Relax, breathe, think twice what you're going to say. Because I feel again, although maybe they want to hack you, although maybe they want to, to give you their telephone number very quickly, they're going to wait, okay? They're going to be very calm, <laughs> okay? Maybe in one week they want to, they feel they love you, but they want to wait. Okay? Maybe they want to travel with you already from the very first moment, but they want to wait. Okay, have to be, <laughs> this, is the, this is the vibes I am receiving. Okay? They're going to be, because this card is talking about as well, purpose, patience. I feel group number two that your soulmate they had to learn how to be patient. They have developed their patience. They have discovered their soul purpose because this card is talking about as well as soul purpose. So I feel group number two that maybe the moment you guys you're going to meet is the moment you discover what's your soul purpose, why you came here. And I feel for many of you, not for all of you, but I feel for many of you, both of you guys, you're going to work together as a soul couple, as a soul, yes, in your soul purpose. I feel that both of you guys, you are working on the same, the same soul purpose. How interesting, group number two. Let us shuffle some cards. And these are new cards. <laughs> this is tarot based in rather weight. I feel this one. 
Wow, the magician. And this is crazy. I swear to you. You know, guys, I'm always very sincere. I swear to you, I was... But I didn't say it. I should have said it. <laughs> this was my mistake. I was watching the magician. I was almost going to tell you, guys, why don't you choose as well? Why don't you check out group number three, which is the magician? And look at that. The magician. The card of soul purpose as well, the card of manifestation, the card of magic, the card of I'm connected to spirit, I am connected to source. I think that most of you guys as well, you're natural mediums, you're soulmate, both of you guys. And I was listening to that as well for group number one, but I feel both of you guys, you're even more psychic than group number one. Magic is alive in your life. What you need to be a success will manifest. If you believe it, you can do it. And this is your omen. Both of you guys, you're going to meet in a moment in your lives that you both know that whatever you believe in and you put your time in, you put your love and energy, you're being patient, you will have it. And this is the same vibe with, I was going to say the love of your life, with your soulmate. They are going to put, they're going to express their love towards you through patience, through timing, through dedication, and constancy. I don't know if some of you guys, you have seen the movie uh, Constantine. Okay, there's something about Constantine. And Constantine was a sort of like a light worker, was a sorcerer, a healer. And a sort of a witch. And I feel group number two that all of you guys, you are a mix of everything. I think that all of you guys, you have, you have lived throughout a lot of past lives. Whatever psychic ability or whatever gift you may think of, I think that all, all of you guys, you are masters. So you're just about to become masters of all gifts <laughs> from universe really it, it's 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 crazy the the messages that i'm receiving wow and again as i was saying in group number one this connection is going to be the way they're going to express you their love as well it's going to be different it's going to be magical it's going to be they're going to express you their love in a relaxed way in a patient way they're not in a rush and I feel that in the past, they were in relationships like that. Everything too intense, too fast, and everything finished too fast, too soon, or in an awkward way. And they don't want to make the same mistake with you. They have learned the lesson very well. Maybe I'm talking about you as well, because sometimes I describe you guys, you're so weird, and I'm describing you as well. Okay. And I sense like a sort of twin flame vibes as well here. Okay, my loves, and I feel that most of you guys, you thought you met the one before and you understood through time that they were not the one. They were a lesson to be learned as well, a challenge, and you overcome that. So, well done. Good for you. And let us shuffle another one, my loves. Okay. And I'm listening from Spirit that whatever distraction they have, whatever happens around them okay like right now right now i'm recording and there's sound outside and if it was sound in the past i would get very nervous or i would get disappointed or i would stop the reading until it, there was silence but my spirits my team of light have taught me anna although you there's sound around you there's noise continue continue with your soul purpose feel grounded be in contact with your center. And this is what I feel that whatever happens around both of you guys, both of you guys, you will remain grounded. So the way your soulmate is going to express you the love as well, it's going to be, and I'm feeling sensuality, a lot of sensuality as well. <laughs> the way they move, the way they dance, you're going to go like, okay. <laughs> I did not see those movements coming. <laughs> okay, I think that they're going to surprise you as well. Look at that. Wow. We have, the, we have the prince, well, the princess of wands. Okay. Prince of wands. Sensitive, open-hearted, inexperienced, moody, 
messages, reading relationships, new emotional experiences, romantic encounters, social invitations or events. What did I tell you guys? Social invitation at events is what you guys probably you're going to meet. Heightened psychic abilities, yes. And I feel that both of you guys, you're going to, the way, and they're going to tell you, this is the first time I'm feeling something like this. I feel like this was my first love. And maybe some of them, they have divorced. Or maybe some of them, they, and they're going to tell you, I was so burned out two years ago. I was so burned out a few months ago. And with you, I feel like, whoa, this is a fresh new start. This is the opportunity from, from heaven. This is an opportunity from God. And I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it. I'm going to take care of you. I'm listening. They want to be a provider for you. They want you to feel like this is a new love for you as well. That this is a new experience. So that's why it sounds like a lot of caring. They're going to take care of all of the details. They're going to be very romantic, very sensual. I feel again, again, I tell you guys, I'm not telling you that your swimming is not sexual, but I feel more sensuality. Because I was explaining, I don't know, I like dancing as well. And I was feeling like moving like that, yes. So the way they move, even like a snake, you know, I'm feeling like vibes of Kundalini energy, like I feel you, but again, I want to remain balanced. Whatever circumstance I'm going through, I'm not going to, I'm not going to talk to you wrong. I'm not going to answer it to you in a bad way. I'm not going to avoid your messages because I am, I am stressed right now in work or I'm stressed with university and work. No, I'm going to take care of you. I'm going to make sure that you feel good. Again, I'm listening. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm falling in love. <laughs> Just listening to the messages. So <laughs> these are new cards as well. Oh, I'm so happy for you guys. Number two. You deserve this kind of love. Absolutely. Wow. Spirit, soul, path. Look at that. Spirit, soul, path. A personal evolution within your relationship. And your soulmate is going to tell you, I am learning so much with you. And I feel you too, you're going to feel that with your soulmate. Both of you guys, you were asking God, universe, light, source, however you want to call it. God, source, light. I want somebody that, I want to, to evolve spiritually with somebody. It's not just that I want to have fun and enjoy, but I want somebody that brings me peace. I want somebody that... Um, that I can learn something from him or her. Maybe some of you guys, you're so intelligent that it's difficult for you to learn from others. It's like, oh my gosh, I want somebody that is really smart. I want somebody intelligent. So this is the person that you're calling in. And both of you guys, it's so important that there's going to be a very beautiful connection from soul to soul. That both of you guys, you work in your soul purpose. And again, group, and again, group number two, I feel that both of you guys, you are going to, many of you, you're going to work together in the same soul purpose, okay? Working together in the same business, having your own business. Or maybe both of you guys, you're working or you're going to work in different companies, but you're going to do something different. It could be like, for example, this is something I give money to, which is, ah, if I remember right, it's water charity. So more and more people from all around the world can have good water and healthy water. And I feel both of you guys, you're going to do something like that. You're going to create an organization or a group to help others. Maybe you could, maybe some of you guys, you're going to help others, people that are suffering of depression because you had, I'm so sorry for that. Maybe in the past you suffered with depression or maybe you knew people that they passed through a very bad moment and you want to give people like this free service um, or maybe it's not that, but it's something or saying, um, maybe you want to, to create this organization so you can receive money from your subscribers and you can help a, a hospital, a hospital to, to study how to, I don't know, for a, a specific illness. I see both of you guys, you're very generous. Sorry, my, my love, so I was not explaining myself well, but you understood me. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> and I'm watching a lot of blonde, 
people. So this is telling me a lot of Pleiadian energy, okay? Here in group number two. And let us shuffle. Wow. What a beautiful energy. And protest. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Both of you guys, you're Pleiadians. I am sure you're Pleiadians masters. Or oh, there are a lot of Pleiadians uh, starseed guides working with you. Protest. Inadequacy is your attention. You see, both of you guys, you're going to become such a powerful, revolutionary couple. Although you give vibes of tenderness, peacefulness, people are going to trust you. People know that you're balanced. Both of you guys, you're going to really create something new. Okay, something revolutionary. Both of you guys, you are a little bit against of the system or a little bit against of the standards. No, you want to show people that they have to do what makes them happy and they can create an abandoned life through that way as well. So I feel both of you guys again, you are very advanced souls, okay? I think that many of you as well, you are Andromedan souls, okay, Andromedan. Andromeda and starseeds are very related to angels. My loves, let us shuffle. You can, you, um, yes, I'm going to shuffle some tea leaf oracle. Well, no, no. They're yeah, telling me to get these ones. Okay, they're telling me to get these two. Wow, prosperity and stability. So I can tell you already that your soulmate right now is very has is very good economically and they're very stable economically. Again, they want to be a provider. Maybe you are a provider as well, but they want to provide you. They want they not only want to provide you with peacefulness, sensuality, attention, caring vibes, but they want to provide you with a lot of luxury lifestyle or whatever you need they want to provide you and they want to and both of you guys you want to provide the world with you want to help people you want to show people that they can they can have prosperity they can they can be very abundant okay and have a lot of stability in their lives believing themselves working themselves like both of you guys you have done healing themselves being balanced because when we have a balanced life everything flows and everything works in a very beautiful and magical way my loves <laughs> now you can ask spirit a specific question you can ask three okay three questions so group number sorry group number two question number one please angels how can you ascend masters could you answer group number one let go Okay, so answer to question number one. Let go. Oops, sorry. Okay, two and three. Two. No need to worry. And the third question that I suppose you are thinking about right now. Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys. I love your energy. I love, I, I love it. I feel much in resonance with the energy with all of you guys because you know that of course i'm called angels whisper <laughs> my loves oh you are so such beautiful earth angels you're truly earth angels both of you all of you guys if you want to support me my loves of course give it a like and subscribe it and if you want to support me so i can upload more free videos like these ones again thank you so much for the ones that you're going to proceed using my purple garden link. I'm not working there, but you have incredible psychics, intuitives, astrologers, mediums as well. <laughs> Let me know guys, if you hire the palm reading service, it's so interesting, or the dream interpretation service. I think it's really very, very powerful. And thank you so much for the ones that you're going to proceed. Remember that you just, you just have to pay $10 and purple garden automatically gives you at that very second ten dollars okay for free so thank you so much and my loves have a beautiful day have a beautiful night wherever you are keep shining my hearts my loves hasta luego corazones bye my sweeties bye <laughs>
<laughs> Welcome group number three. I am amazed about the stuff that is happening for you guys. Okay, I'm going to make a summary. I was recording yesterday, the third group. I didn't have enough storage in my iPad and by mistake, by mistake, I erased third group. Okay? Now, this is the next day. I am recording again. I thought I was recording. Okay, I had these two cards coming out. So I'm going to leave them here. And I noticed suddenly my guides told me, look up, and I was not recording. So this is a very, 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 I'm going to put it like this. This is a very important message for group number three. Okay, my loves, you chose the magician. This is already telling you because I kept listening vibes and energy from Shiva, from goddesses like Venus, Isis, okay. I sense a lot of energy from goddesses and gods with all of you guys, and um, more goddesses, whether you're a man or a woman. You have a very powerful god uh, or goddess working with you side by side since many past lives. And she is trying to come through, <laughs> through this reading to tell you something. In order for you to make space for this incredible soulmate that she's trying to send you, She's trying to help both of you guys to find one and another, like the infinite symbol, okay? And Shiva was telling me, and I'm sorry guys if I'm saying it's a goddess, I think Shiva is a goddess, I'm sorry if it's a god, excuse me, but I am a medium, <laughs> I don't know all of the god and goddesses, but I, I sense a lot of, of Shiva and Isis and Venus. So Shiva was telling me about like the infinite symbol that both of you guys, you are like in different roads right now, or maybe you were, maybe this is a confirmation that you have met this person, okay? All of the whole reading is going to be a confirmation. That you have been in roads, like trying, meeting more people, experiencing, evolving. Okay, suddenly both of you guys, you're going to find one another in the exact center point, okay, my loves? You're going to find one another in the perfect timing, in the perfect moment, in a balance point. Not before, not after. So if you are asking why you did not meet this soulmate before, it's because, again, besides we have the three of swords. Okay, let me read it. I love these cards. These cards are new. So you can understand better. And I love the picture. Look at the angel, how it's trying to heal you. Great sadness that will heal with time. Let go of the past. Personal growth that comes from challenges. Healing man is healing misunderstandings, being there for those in need. So the reason why this person has not come through yet is because you need to forgive yourself and forgive others and clean, because I'm watching the sword and this reminds me of St. Michael Archangel, clean all of the energy from other people, not only from excess, but from people that are still blocking you to receive blessings. Not only this loving relationship, but to receive blessings in general. Because you're a great manifestator. The card of the magician, El Mago, it's the, the best card of, of manifesting. It has the four elements, okay? It has the wand, the sword, the pentacle, and the cup, okay? The cup here. Okay, my love? So, you have everything, everything. You, it's, there's no, it's not, I don't know if some, it's, yeah, I don't know if suddenly, or lately you have been thinking, is there anything wrong with me? Am I doing anything wrong? Am I making mistakes with the techniques of manifestation? No, there's no mistake. No, everything's preparing you for this moment. But if you still, if you still, maybe some of you guys, you're grabbing a past story or you're following somebody and you think he or she's the one and time passes by, time passes by, whether it's a celebrity or not. I don't care about that, but... If you are following somebody, if you are with somebody in your mind and time is passing by, be practical. If things are not happening, are not happening, are not happening. I don't know if some readers have told you, I don't know, maybe you're paying a reader because they're readers and they're readers, okay? <laughs> they're readers that have healed, they're readers that have not healed and they want money and money and money. They don't care about you. This is a reality. There are good readers, there are bad readers, okay? So, if you are kept, maybe this is not a specific person, but if you still, if pain still is affecting you, 
you need to continue techniques, techniques, techniques like oponopono, like maybe a lot of guided meditations, maybe hypnotherapy, it would work for you, maybe therapy, a psychologist, try anything to release yourself from the past. But you need a you need a conversation with yourself. You need an aha moment because you're very good. Again, I tell you, it's not only that you are attracting, you, you have really, you have the potential to have an amazing life. Group number three. Okay? But you need to forgive yourself and forgive others and forgive the past. Okay? Then we have the second card. Okay? Well, this is the... Uh, by the description, because these are new cards, I believe this is the, yes, the three of wands. So do what you love. Recognition for the highest quality of work. Especially creative endeavors, being paid well for your craft. Okay, working well with others, an excellent reputation. And I did not notice in the other groups, but we have letters here, A, Z, and R, G. Okay, and we have a lot of threes, which is the number of manifesting of masters. And I was saying before, when I was not recording, <laughs> I'm going, I'm recording now. I was saying before that the way your soulmate is going to express the love towards you is they're going to treat you. They're going to see you like a god, like a goddess that you are. They're going to help you boost your self-esteem. They're going to help you heal your past. They're not going to judge you. They're going to treat you like heaven. You're going to feel like in heaven. They're going to put a lot of detail into this relationship. What, I, what do I mean like that? They're going to make sure that you're comfortable. They want to make sure that you're happy. They want to make sure that you're not going to leave. They want to make sure that this, that you're going to fall in love deeply and not only for one month, three months and one year. No, they want to spend their whole life with you. You see how she's so being so carefully and what a beauty, what a beautiful creation she's making. And this for me, it reminds me of the card of the judgment. You have been waiting for somebody to save you, maybe in the past. You were waiting for love, like, oh, I feel sad. I, if I'm with the one, or if I'm with a soulmate, I will, I will feel better. Oh, things are not going well. I don't feel loved. If I find the one, I will feel loved. And that's the reason why you did not meet your soulmate yet. Because you needed to discover yourself. You, you needed to understand that you, you, group number th three, sorry, <laughs> thriving, I was going to say, <laughs> to thrive, you needed to learn that you are the most loving person to yourself. You are the one that is going to bring you happiness. And when you are in that space of, I am feeling good with myself, I am feeling good. I am feeling not only good, I'm feeling <laughs> very good. That's the moment that more blessings will come to you. More blessings, more blessings, and more blessings. So again, your soulmate, it's going to make a big, big effort. And why are you attracting such an incredible, and it seems perfect, soulmate towards you? Because you are healing. You're understanding that if you, if you don't love yourself, you will not attract people that love themselves. We are, you, we are constantly attracting how we are vibing. So good for you, group number three, because I know you have been passing through a lot of challenges. I know, my love. I know it has not been easy. But you, are, you have such incredible light inside and outside. You have a lot of angels helping you out. And you have a, lot, and you have a very strong, strong, powerful goddess working with you. And it's a goddess. It's not a master and a guide only. It's a goddess as well. So you're very powerful. But you needed to stop escaping from yourself because of pain. And you needed to find yourself and to fall in love with yourself. So good for you. If you have already done it or you're just about to do it. <laughs> so, so let us uh, shuffle. This is new Oracle. You see. You see how it has jumped. Look. Loss. Sorrow, damage. Again, I know, my love, I know maybe you have lost somebody, an animal, somebody you really loved, okay? 
maybe a family member, a friend, and I understand my love, I understand. But let me tell you, they are there, like you're part of your angel team. They are there with you, okay? They are there with you, absolutely. Maybe you're watching a lot of numbers of 13, which is abundance, it's new life. It's radical change, okay? Let, let us see the other ones. Let us get, look, I'm going to get all of them. Come, you see? Number 14, inner peace, strength, meditation. And you need it to, again, look, she's, I didn't say it. She's meditating. This is the key for you. And I feel that many of you, you have been connecting with this incredible summit through your guided meditation. Calmness. You needed to come to this space to, in order to be able to heal trauma, to heal pain. And you're doing very well. Okay. Yes, go, live and learn and promise. You see, you're going to be married with this soulmate. Responsible confirmation assurance. This is the assurance that your goal about this soulmate that you're trying to manifest Purpose, expectation, destination, this is your destiny, live and learn. You needed to live and learn through all of these challenges, to experience, to be training with, with your team light and develop yourself in order to get to this goal and to the rest of your goals. So good for you. Yes, 8, 28. Okay, we have 26, 27, 28. We have, this is, if we sum 2 and 8, this is completion. So you're going to manifest this. Absolutely. Don't have any doubt about that. No. You're doing amazing. You're doing amazing because you're amazing. <laughs> However, how many people try to, to make you believe you were nothing or you were something different or you were a bad person or you were weird. No, that's their stuff. That's their stuff. It was not you. And I'm so happy that... Maybe I'm talking about your past and this is your confirmation, okay, my loves? And I'm sorry, guys, maybe some of you guys, you have already left this, this, this moment of healing deeply, your trauma, but some, some viewers have not, and that's why I have to say it. So thank you so much for your patience. So my loves, let us continue. Let's shuffle. This is a very powerful, this is, these are very powerful messages. So I, now I understand why I had to repeat the video again. Okay. You see, love language, quality time. Absolutely. Be the witness to each other's lives. You see, your soulmate, again, this reminds me again of this, where's this woman? This reminds me again how she's so careful with the statue. How he's so careful. Whether you want to, if, whether you're a woman, you want to meet a woman, maybe you're a man, you want to meet a man, or you're heterosexual or bisexual. <laughs> How your soulmate is going to be so careful, so tender. They want to make sure you are happy, you feel comfortable, you feel safe. Okay? So I understand that they're going to know about your past story. Maybe they're coming through, maybe they're coming too from a past uh, that it's very that it was very damaging for them too and that's why they're like that <laughs> so again they're going to treat you like a prince like a princess like a god like a goddess like okay yes like they're going to feel like i have to take care of him i have to take care of the, of her i i sense a lot of vibes of oh, i want you to to feel like so comfortable and so safe like you you've never ever felt before but i feel again group number three that you have been working on this yourself and that's why you are attracting a soulmate like that because we attract again how we vibe aunties the energy and this is so fun oh, i love it the energy is fun and light-hearted but uncertain okay again i feel I feel that you come from past stories that people, you feel like they were playing with you and your emotions. Or maybe some of you, you were playing with others. It could be, okay, this is a general reading. So I feel that there's going to be a lot of playfulness between both, but there's not going to be uncertain. I feel that this is more talking about the past, okay? I have to be sincere. You know, guys, that are more a medium. And let's get this one, manifesting the one. Oh my gosh. 
And we have the card of manifesting of the magician. Very soon, your true love will arrive. Look at that. You see? You believe now? Group number three, you believe now? Please do not get stuck in past stories. Use any type of technique to help you move on. You can do it. You can do it. <laughs> of course you can do it. And you're manifesting. And guys, I wanted to say uh, physically, I didn't say this uh, in the other groups, but I sense if you want to meet a man, he's quite strong. Okay? And it could be toned skin, color skin, even darker toned color skin, blonde, dark black, hazel. And if you want to meet a woman, I think that she likes, she, she loves red nails. It could be or red lips like that. She's very sexy. She's very sexy. Both of them, they're very sexy. <laughs> Although you're going to treat one another very, in a very, you're going to bring a lot of peacefulness to one another. Okay, again, both of you guys, you're going to feel safe. You can be yourself. You can be open in sex, no judgment, beautiful communication. Again, th this loss energy, this pain, it's over. I mean, again, things may happen in life because we're in the third dimension. But, although energetically, we're already in the fifth dimension. <laughs> but... Things can happen and it's understandable. Again, I feel that the worst part of your love story or those, or that trauma that you passed through, and I'm so sorry for that, I send you a big hug, it's over, okay? So whatever happens, whatever challenge happens from now on, in general in your life, group number three, you're going to overcome it. And even better, <laughs> easier with your partner. <laughs> and we understand, <laughs> okay? <laughs> so my guys. Let us shuffle some. I'm so, I'm so proud of all of you. I don't know if you need to listen to this. I am so proud of you. You are so brave. You are so beautiful. You are so beautiful. I, have to, I feel I have to say this. And you deserve the best. <laughs> Expansion. Look at that. Spirit Garden of Summer. Okay, so many of you guys, you're going to meet this summer in summertime. Or you're going to be already with this person in summer. And this is news. And, we ha and I love it because we have the yellow. Maybe, guys, you should check group number three because we have the, the yellow feather and the card of the sun. And I feel that's m talking more information about your future. Again, if you want a more specific reading, and if you want to support my work, you have my Purple Garden link, right? It's just $10, and they give you $10 for free. But again, we see, are these, are these apples or peaches? But again, you see that both of you guys, you're going to create a very beautiful, nourishing relationship together. And I feel that communication is going to be the key in this relationship. The way they're going to express their love towards you is with a lot of tenderness, a lot of sexuality as well, <laughs> a lot of chemistry, and a lot of communication. I feel that this person is not just only of texting. They need to listen to your voice. You're going to love their voice. You're going to love the way they talk to you. They, you know, you're going to love their love language, their love, the way they communicate, the way they express their love. You're going to really... Again, group number three. I know that it sounds like too perfect, but the, the, this happens every day. Yes, it does. Okay, and we have the number 37. Field mouse. Success, yes. Oh my gosh. Believe in yourself and dare to dream big. Absolutely, dare to dream big. Because you are truly manifesting the one that you are going to marry. You are. And we see it so beautiful because we have all of the colors. You see? We have these colors in this card. We have the pink one in his trousers. Look at that. Success. Yes, my love. Yes. Come on. You can do this. You can do this. <laughs> My angel, before we end up the reading, my loves, if you want to ask a specific question to spirit, again, this is a general reading, but, okay, 
first question, you could uh, say it aloud or mentally. Please, angels, archangels, ascended the masters, could you answer group number one? Go, the time is right. Absolutely. It was not the correct time back then because you needed to heal trauma. It's understandable, love. Please don't be hard on yourself. You're doing so good. Yes. And both of you guys, you know, you're going to, I think that you're going to recognize one another very quickly. Sorry, that this was the answer maybe to, to a quest, different question. But for me, it's the confirmation what we were talking about. And let's see with the next question. Not the right time, okay? For the second question, not the right time, okay? Have you been a little bit obsessed or worried about time? Oh my gosh, I'm getting old. Oh my gosh, I want to become a mom or a dad. Oh my gosh, I should be married. Please don't pressure yourself. That's society. It's a sort of manipulation. If they make us feel like nothing or if they make us feel like there's something wrong with us, we are so easy to manipulate. Be careful with that. You're, you're here to live your life. Don't care what your society, your culture tells you, your family or whoever. It's your life. It's your rules. Remember, you have a strong goddess with you. Don't forget who you are. And I'm, and I'm listening from spirit. Stop dimming your light. Your soulmate is going to help you with this. It's going to raise all, all of that light that maybe others are trying to put you down, put you down. Why? Because they see that you're different. They see that you're special. And when we believe the lies from others, because they are operating from trauma as well, things are, oh my gosh, things are not happening, are not happening, are not happening. But in your case, you know how this works. You know how it works right now. And things are flowing, will be flowing. Third question. <laughs> okay. <laughs> wait. Okay, wait. Again, another thing about timing. Do not worry about timing. It will happen in the perfect timing. Okay. Trust. Trust. It will be happening. Okay. This will happen. This is not an illusion. You're going to find your soulmate. And maybe you have found your soulmate. Both of you guys, you're going to be very, a very happy marriage. Really. Please, don't doubt it. <laughs> Group number three. I hope, well, we, we hope, me and my team of life, we hope we have really helped you. Very powerful, the messages in this group. Some, some days are like this. Some days and some groups are like, whoa. And even me, I say, wow. That was a very strong and a feeling goosebumps and very powerful. Very powerful message. You're doing amazing. I'm a love. See if you have liked it, you know, give me a like, subscribe in. And if you want to support my work with just $10, you can use my purple garden link, which is trypurplegarden.com slash Anna Robertson. And purple garden gives you directly, automatically $10. And you can choose there. They have incredible advices. I'm not working there, but you have more experience. More, sorry, more experienced tarotists over there. So thank you for, sorry. Thank you so much. I was telling you a lot. Thank you so much for the ones that you're going to proceed. I love you guys. Have a beautiful day. And really, you are amazing. Kisses, my loves. Bye.